What's going on, peeps? Welcome to the channel. Before we get rolling in today's video, I just wanted to take a second to thank everyone who has subscribed to the channel. We just hit 3,000 subscribers a couple of days ago, and I just wanted to say thank you. In today's video, we'll take a look at a character that has appeared in less than 10 issues of Marvel Comics, but he's worth covering because we may see him in live action soon in the Hawkeye series. Let's find out who is the man they call the clown. Kazimir Kazimierczyk was part of his family circus. During wartime, the circus was burnt to the ground. Kazi and his best friend Yannick survived. The two tried to scavenge enough to buy their way across the border. They were caught looting a home by a couple of soldiers, but were saved by an apparent member of the tracksuit mafia. They were taken in by the tracksuit mafia and performed their circus act to entertain their new friends. One evening, there was an explosion in the subway which killed his best friend Yannick. This began his transformation into the clown. First he killed just to kill, but soon he found he could make a living doing it. He became a ruthless assassin, strangling, shooting, drowning, and even burning his victims. Kazi began working for the tracksuit mafia in the United States. The tracksuit mafia offered their services to a group of crime bosses who wanted Clint Barton, the original Hawkeye, dead because of his interference in their affairs. The clown was given the job of eliminating Barton. The tracksuit mafia had their own agenda as well. They wanted the apartment complex that Barton was the acting superintendent of. Barton had taken it from a member of the tracksuit mafia. The clown started by sending Barton a message by killing one of his neighbors they called Grills. When Kazi found out Barton had illegally taken over the apartment complex and could not call the cops for assistance, discretion was out the window. He ambushed Clint and his brother Barney in the apartment complex, leaving Barton partially deaf and his brother Barney in a wheelchair. Kazi returned when Clint and his brother had been released from the hospital, and he brought tracksuit mafia members with him for firepower. They launched an all-out assault on the apartment complex. But Barton had organized the tenants to fight back and the Mafia members were met with heavy resistance. The building tenants managed to hold off the tracksuit Mafia while Clint Barton and the Clown faced off. With the assistance of Kate Bishop, Kazi, the Clown, was subdued. Are you excited for the Hawkeye series? Do you think we'll see Kazi the Clown? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Well. As always, I appreciate you taking the time out of your busy day to stop by the channel and check out my videos. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you again real, real soon. I'm gone. Peace.